Hey, I'm JC Frias. I'm from Texas, living in Utah, with my partner of three years and our pets. I love hosting dinner parties and gatherings, and enjoy making everything look adorable in my home. Join me on learning some tips of doing it yourself and being creative. So today I am doing a video of my laundry room. It is such a mess. I'm kind of embarrassed that I am doing this video, but here it goes. Um, I organized it and then it wasn't organized and then I did and then it wasn't. And it's just become like a mod podge of things. And then I just always shut the door when company comes over so no one looks in there. I don't know if you guys can relate or not. And um, it's not very cute. So I decided to kind of make it so that my whole house ties in and that was one of the places that needed some work. So I worked really hard and I hope some of these tips work out for you guys. And any questions, comments, again, just leave them at the bottom and or message me on my page and I'm happy to answer any. So hope at least one of these tips helps you out. So this is my laundry room. And it is a mess. And I've come up with a plan to organize it. And some tips for you as well to organize this mess of a room. So in order to get this organized and looking beautiful, um, I just need to see what the problem is. I have tons of crap in here. I have vacuums and steamers and dog food and dog treats and pots and pans. And this place is just a mess. I, it's just not working and I need to get rid of some of that stuff. Um, my goal is always to just make every room kind of blend in together, like my living room and everything, and this is not blending. And so, I need to put some of the stuff away in a different storage and organize it. Also, fold that laundry, that would help, and get rid of some of these plastic things up here and just hide some stuff and make it accessible but yet hidden to the eye. So, let's get going. So again, just trying to tie in everything together. I'm super excited because I organized it and it looks super cute. So this shelf right here, I bought it at Walmart like five years ago. And it was like when I was in college and now I have a grown up house and I put it in our shed. And I just decided, well, why don't I bring it out and paint it? If you saw my other video, I had bought like paint for like the seafoam color paint and I have so much of it. So I just decided, let's splash some paint and just make it look gorgeous. So I did that and it came with like this like cover in the back that you like nail in the back. And I took that off and just having it all open so it looks super clean. And so this is what I did with it. And then um, one of the tips um, to get things uncluttered and just looking good is to have baskets. Baskets, baskets, baskets. I'm in love with baskets. Um, they will help organize and group things together together just make sure it doesn't become like a junk drawer and you're just throwing stuff in there um, you can label it or just put little cute tags I just put like letters and different things like that um, Brian might not know where everything's at but I know where everything's at so have all that and then like in this basket I just have like um, some of the spices and some of the canned foods that we buy in bulk I just put it in here still and then the other thing is just get little other baskets to um, put other things like in here I have like the shower and just some scrub brushes and stuff like that and then in here this is a cute little tip is I hate all the packaging and making things I, I just don't like it so I went ahead and took um, the laundry um, what are these called? dryer sheets out of the box and put them in this cute little basket and then it makes the room smell good as well and they're just out on display and just really cute. Also have my soap so that they're reachable. Just make sure that everything you put in baskets, it's 
easily accessible and that you know where it's going to be at and it's not a burden to put it in baskets. Um, take stuff out of like the packaging and actually just use it and display it. It looks really cute that way. And then again, like I said, I wanted to kind of like feel like my home is in here as well and it's not just like somewhere where I go and throw stuff. So then even adding like, I added these like little potted faces on top of my shelf to make them look cute. And then if you saw my other video, I did like a lampshade out of like sheets. I decoupaged it and I also have that lamp in here. So just something cute to make it all tie in and look amazing. So another tip that you can do is label your stuff. This one, it just says clean on it. It's again, a lot of the extra stuff that I have and I just put that little label on there. But it looks cute and it ties in. I also folded my towels so it looks very sharp in here. So then over here, Again, I went and labeled it. That's kind of peeling off, but you guys get it. And then this one's really easy because it's just a little caddy that you can take down. And that's the one we are, where we usually use um, to clean the house. So all of that is in there. So then I have some towels there as well to wash, um, to dry my hands if I need them or anything. And then this is something cute. I saw it done in Pinterest. And, um... You just put your detergent in one of these little um, drink dispensers and you have it accessible. And again, you don't have all the brand driven stuff. Super easy. And then I had this little teacup that I just labeled it as well. Um, so we don't drink out of that anymore. And so yeah, just thought that was super adorable. I am just loving this new laundry room. Super cute to make it look more homey. I added a yellow frame I painted, a bird's wreath I decorated, and a sea foam frame. I went ahead and just put this tray with two little towels there that I can use. And then I have this little pedestal that I bought. Love it. And it made its way here to my laundry room. And in case I'm doing my laundry and I find change or anything, I can just set it up on there as I'm cleaning that out of the pockets. So... Yep, this is my cute laundry room. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. So that is my new and improved laundry room. I'm super excited for it. Um, I think it looks really cute. Nothing major, but just some small fixes. And it makes a huge difference. Hopefully you guys enjoyed.